everyone and welcome back to my channel. Kelly S. Williams from Family Matters posted a touching tribute to Naya Rivera along with a throwback photo from the late actress's appearance on The 90 Show. Only hours after the Ventura County Sheriff's Office confirmed that they had recovered Naya Rivera's body from Lake Piru in California, her fans and former co-stars had taken it to social media to share their grief. In a heartfelt tribute, Family Matters star Kelly S. Williams wrote... R.I.P. Naya, my thoughts and prayers go out to her loved ones, especially her son. The touching throwback photo was from an episode of Family Matters, during which Kelly, Naya and Brighton McClure were seated on the family couch. This is how I will always remember Naya, as Gwendolyn, commented one person. Another fan added, wow, prayers up to all her loved ones, may she rest. Another person expressed their surprise that she stood hard on the show. The Ventura County Medical Examiner told the BBC that Naya's cause of death was accidental drowning. The actress had rented a boat with her son, Josie Hollis Dorsey, when she fell overboard. Bill Ayub from the Venturi County Sheriff explained, She mustered enough energy to get her son back on the boat, but not enough to save herself. Naya's four-year-old was found asleep on the boat. They had rented hours after footage captured them, leaving the dock and heading towards the water. It was reported Josie was found safe and healthy. He was later reunited with his father and Naya's ex-husband, Ryan Dorsey. Naya's co-stars from the hit show Glee also paid tribute to her hours after her body was recovered from Lake Peru. They were pictured looking into the distance and standing arm in arm along the shores where the actress met her untimely death. Naya played the character of a cheerleader named Satana on Glee from 2009 to 2015. It was her breakout role since her many featured parts as a child star actress. The young actress is survived by a son who had been in Ryan's care since her passing. Naya divorced her ex-husband in 2018 after four years of marriage. Thanks for listening. Please like, comment and subscribe.